What's going on guys, my name is Joey Biagas and I'm an audio engineer and musician of a few years now. And today I'm gonna to show you how to use Audacity on a Mac to create a karaoke track. So let's get to it. All right guys, so let's go ahead and use Audacity on a Mac to create a karaoke. Now a karaoke is basically a song without the vocals. So it's just in the instrumental part. So let's go ahead and create that. There's a couple different ways and I'm gonna show you both, but I'm pretty sure I know which one you're gonna choose. But anyway, let, the first step is obviously opening up Audacity. And let's go ahead and import a song and I have one here that's ready. It's one of my own songs called I Fell In Love With A Liar. All right, so click and drag into Audacity and it should take just a second. Boom, all right. So let's go ahead and first of all, I'm gonna play the track for you just so you kind of get a feel for it and you can listen to the vocals and everything. And uh, let's go ahead and play the chorus. It's somewhere around right here. It's over, I'm over. All right, you get the idea. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm gonna do this the, uh, I guess the manual way first. So first of all, let's go ahead and cruise over to the name of the track or this little arrow, click on the arrow, cruise down to split stereo track, okay? So that's gonna split our left and right channels to two separate channels. Okay, so now we're gonna select the right channel. And to be honest, it doesn't matter which one you select, just make sure you're selecting one or the other. Okay, so select one, either left or the right. In my case, I'm selecting the right. And I'm gonna cruise up to the effect, and then I'm gonna select invert. Okay, we just wanna invert just one side, not both of them, okay? And then it'll just do its thing, and then boom, you'll see it inverted the waveform, and basically made the waveform upside down, the opposite of what it used to be. All right, now, we're not done yet. Let's go ahead and select that uh, down arrow again, and we're gonna switch this to mono, all right? And we're gonna switch the left channel back to mono as well. Now what this does is it cancels the center channel, which are where the vocals are. So let's go ahead and take a listen to that chorus one more time. All right, perfect. That's exactly what we wanted. We wanted to get rid of those vocals and it's gone. But let me go ahead and show you one quick way. I'm gonna Apple Z or undo this. Oh, went one too far. Okay, we're back to our stereo track, right? So what you can do is obviously select the track. Now go to effect and go all the way down to vocal removal for center pan vocals. And this basically does everything that I just did, but all in one swoop and then you can just hit okay. You know, it'll, it'll do its thing. Boom. Now let's take a listen again, one more time. All right, see, same exact end product, but two different ways, and again, I'm pretty sure I know which method you're gonna choose within Audacity, but there you guys go. So that's pretty much it in how to create a karaoke track. If you do have any other questions, please let us know, but thank you for watching.